I would say strongly that RPA is a survival tool, a survival skill for any GPS nowadays. We have all been dealing with robots on a daily basis, knowingly or unknowingly. Uh, think about the last time you went to an ATM to withdraw money, or think about the last time you went to a vending machine to get a ticket. So we are taking away the rule-based part of the work from the human to a bot. The advice I would give to business leaders is just do it. The big advantage of RPA is that we are not talking about a huge uh, IT integration or system effort which takes you know months to plan, months to deliver. But uh, this is something which you can really get started uh, from the ground up quite, quite quickly. It's really not difficult to get it started, especially here in, in Lithuania. Naturally, you're forced to invent some things, to create something from scratch, because you cannot find it somewhere around. So that's why we needed, you know, such curious, fast learners, uh, people, uh, which we found here in, in Vilnius. And we did it very successfully, actually. When we talk about intelligence process automation, I think this is a topic for everyone. And so playing the game together is always about being collaborative between the government and the enterprises. We believe that machine learning and artificial intelligence will become second and the third force. So we'll start from RPA and we'll go to machine learning and other technologies.